Hey guys, Sam here, and welcome to another Tennis Express Racket Review. Today we focus on the long-awaited Yonex E-Zone 98 Tour. The tagline for the E-Zone series is Seize the Power, and this fits the brand perfectly. With the 6th generation E-Zone rackets, Yonex incorporated a strong elastic material in the throat called M40X to simultaneously increase stability and maintain flex. The new E-Zone Tour has vibration dampening mesh inside the handle which vastly ups the comfort factor over the previous generation. The isometric shaped hoop is slightly wider at the three and nine o'clock positions to maximize the size of the sweet spot. With a strong weight of 11.7 ounces, a softer 63 flex and a higher swing weight of 329, the Ezo 98 Tour features a four points headlight balance. The Ezo 98 looks to be a versatile option for explosive shot makers. I can tell you from personal experience that Chris and Jeannie both enjoyed this play test because I was on the receiving end. Let's hear their thoughts. The new Yonex EZO 98 Tour was a little bit of a surprise to me. Just like the EZO 98 and 98 Plus, I enjoyed hitting with this frame from the baseline. I could comfortably blast my shots deep into the corners and take offense right away. Due to the increased weight, there is slightly better control, precision, and stability than the standard EZO 98 version. The only trouble I found was when I came to the net or needed to hit defensive shots. Due to the E-Zone's natural power, I would still unintentionally overhit at times. Overall though, it's a great update from Yonex and it fits right into their lineup. If you're looking for an E-Zone with more control and stability, then you should give the E-Zone 98 Tour a shot. I was very impressed by the fact that even though I was trying to play with more power, it would give me a lot more precision as well within the shot. Uh, especially on my forehand or my backhand. I also like the fact that even on the serve, whenever I was you know, hitting my serves, it would give me a lot more uh, different depth to it and different looks uh, for my opponent to really kind of not read where the ball is going or just to have a different uh, spin when it goes back on the other side of the court. If you're looking for a racket that has a lot of impact within your shots, such as your serve, your forehand, and also your volleys, and will give you a lot of power and spin and very much comfortability, I would recommend these rackets to players out there that are looking for those qualities and are willing to try something new and different. This is the racket that you should give a shot to. A lot of what makes the E-Zone franchise so popular is that it's a very nimble racket, it's versatile, uh, you can generate lots of racket head speed from, from compromised positions on the court. And to be honest with you, the E-Zone Tour, I struggled a little bit more with it um, when compared to the E-Zone 98. The Tour has that 11.1 ounce unstrung weight, so there's more racket to get through the air. Uh, your trade-off is gonna be, um, and I noticed it on the court, like I got more stability up at the net, uh, particularly playing first volleys. I had a harder time from the back of the court. I felt like I was late with a lot of my shots, and that could be due to the slightly head heavier balance on the E-Zone Tour. So if, if you're a big hitting player and you wanted more stability and more weight than the regular E-Zone provided, then the E-Zone 98 Tour is gonna be right in your wheelhouse. All in all, the E-Zone Tour keeps a good thing going from the E-Zone models with Yonex. The frame is heavier, so it's gonna be more stable and hold up to bigger hitters better than the regular 98. Thanks for checking out our Tennis Express Racket Review of the Yonex E-Zone 98 Tour. For more information on the frame and our demo string of choice, check out the info below. As always, keep it right here at Tennis Express for the latest and greatest product reviews and releases from all your favorite brands. Thanks for watching and don't forget to click that notification bell to find out when we post new content.